I know it's been a while since I've done a video. Well, actually, uploaded a video, should I say. I've done videos. And the reason why is that PlayStation 4 Pro, I've had a big issue with it. I have an issue with Sony. I'll get more into that with my um, game unboxing. So, look into that video, figure out um, <laughs> what I'm about to go through and talk about. <laughs> but, oh, uh, man. Got my horror pack. See, notice I don't have the DVDs. That because I unsubscribe to the DVDs. If they ever get a new genre or a different type of um set, I will pick that up because um like I said the DVDs I was preferring more, you know, the obscure type, you know, the more rarer, but you know. DVDs doesn't apply to me what I want, but it might apply to you, so you may want to still get that. It's at a good price, still at twenty dollars, you know. <clears throat> Excuse me. But this is the Blu-ray pack, twenty-five dollars, and every month for the whole year they will have a limited edition. So it's always great to pick that up, and this month was very great. You know, last month was a little bit uh off, but this month was pretty great. And let's take a look. First one we have is George A. Romero's Diary of the Dead. And back when they had the little questions on their website of Horror Pack on Facebook, people off bat already knew it was going to be a dead movie. I put down, I thought it was going to be Land of the Dead. But most people said Diary of the Dead, and they were right. That's exactly what it was. Second Blu ray. We have. The town that dreaded sundown. I've seen this on Amazon so many times. It's, it's advertised on there. And I've always wondered about it. I have not seen it. I've thought about purchasing it, but I didn't have to. I got it in my horror pack. I really want to see how this comes out because like I said they heavily advertised it on Amazon. I'm glad to have it. I didn't have to go out that way. I prefer getting this four pack. And that's why. And here, people guessed this off bat as well. Back when they had questions on the page, they knew automatically it was going to be a, a screen factory. And I kept saying, it's not going to be a screen factory because screen factory is still their mitt. Production of uh, of the like years, like maybe three years ago, their movies are still like in the twenty dollar range, you know. So I'm like, how is the horror pack gonna have Screen Factory movies, you know? But I see why they, they went ahead got an IFC, and IFC has a lot of movies, you know, especially on uh, Screen Factory. So it makes sense now, you know. I hope they continue to go through this process because I see I have not purchased any except for one that was on the Screen Factory uh, IFC. And I'm glad that they're doing this. I hope they continue, like I said, in Dark Summer. It comes with the slip case. I love slip covers. Slip covers, um, steel books, meta books, meta packs. I, I just go crazy for those. <laughs> and it's it's actually pretty good, and um, I'm not going to, especially the same thing and on the inside how the Blu-ray looks, so I'm not going to go all out that ways. And let's take a look at the limited edition that came for January. Chopping block. I've seen this. I've, I've seen it. I know about it. I haven't seen it, so this is another movie I have not seen. I'm glad I didn't purchase it. It's it is a, a horror pack. Number six, Chopping Block. So that's pretty awesome. So that's three movies I have not seen out of four, and I have to say it's. 
they, they did pretty good this month. I highly suggest getting a horror pack. $25 a month, you get four movies and you get yourself a limited edition for this whole year. So that's awesome. And like always, if you enjoy it, go ahead and leave me a like. Leave a comment if you choose to. But please, please, subscribe. I can use the subscribers. Enjoy.